And we're back in studio on the Now Morning Show. Thank you so much, Shamla, for that great segment. And we're about to get into something really, really interesting. Today we have with us in studio, Miss Aura Gordon. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Trinidad and Tobago and the wider world at large. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And Thank this is you. really exciting because today we're talking about your breasts. But with a difference, because Miss Gordon is a breast health and bra educator. And I have to be honest, I wasn't too sure what that was. But you know what? Miss Gordon has explained it to me. And I think you can explain it to our viewers as well. Okay, so um, what I do is I talk about breast health, you know, taking care of your breasts, what you need to do. And being a par part of taking care of your breasts is wearing the proper undergarment the proper bra, because it can affect you in the long run when you do not have on the proper bra and you do not treat your breasts properly. What we want is for those girls to be, you know, always good, always, you know, we have no problems with that area especially. Mm -hmm. And we know that breast cancer is one of the highest, well, it is the highest cancer in the world, yeah. as well as Trinidad and Tobago. It, so mm -hmm, it definitely is and it's something you know we start educating from now from young so from that you young. know because yes. you know it's funny with young ladies you know the first thing you do is you go into a training bra that's the beginning and that's basically it for the rest of your life <laughs> yes, yes 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 so in Trinidad and Tobago we were discussing this before um, we came on air we were talking about actually bra fitting yes. and the challenges that we face here what do you think are some of the major challenges that we face when it comes to bra fitting well number one most of the stores that carry bras don't have persons that really uh, that are really trained in um, measuring you and fitting you in a bra or telling you well this is the correct bra and that is not the correct bra they just have bras and you come and say, well, do you need, you need help? Well, you know, try this one and okay, that look good, you know, but they're not taking everything into consideration. Mm -hmm. So there's really no need. So there's just a few people yeah. who I know mm -hmm. that does bra fitting and will be able to do that. So that is why I started, I had a, I got a passion because as growing up, mm -hmm. I always had, I was always heavy mm -hmm. and always had problems to get bras. You know, you wear the bra and then it's the elastic strap and it bursts mm -hmm. and the plastic bottle, um, yep. buckle. So, you know, you're going to school, so you, you put a pin mm -hmm. because the, that is the bra that fits in it the best. Eh? Yes. And if dad start to travel and he would bring down the, the bras and the bone break and it's sticking here. Oh, and, mm. So when, I, <laughs> when my friend in, introduced me yeah. to this brand, to this company, I, 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 I've never turned back from, from, from using that bra. I get the support, I get everything, and I decided to do more research, mm -hmm. and I had a passion for it, and I said, no, I have to come outside and let people know, educate them about, you know, sometimes you, you, don't, you don't know. No, yeah. But when you know now, you're supposed to take what you know, keep it, um, use it for yourself, but also share it. So I am just sharing, sharing, sharing. I couldn't agree more because if it's one thing when it comes to bras, it's not really something that we discuss that much. We no, just know, okay, no. all women have to wear A bras. Bra, we have right. no choice. Yes. But what do you think one of the most important things um, is that women need to look for when they're shopping for a bra? A bra. Okay. Um, you have to know your size. I mean, your shape, mm -hmm. right? Every bra is not, you, every, everybody can't buy the same bra. You have to know your size, your shape. You have, when you go, um, you want something fitting you. Um, this is your thorax area here. Mm -hmm. So you want it fitting snug but not tight. Mm. Um, the center of here of your, your, your breast, the bra should be fitting you, resting against your ribcage. Okay. So it's supposed to separate the breasts. Although they are sisters, they're not twins. <laughs> so they need to be separated. You know? <laughs> That's why you get all that sweating and mm -hmm. all that type of stuff. If it's if it's, it's like how this bra is looking there, if mm -hmm. it's if you're getting a ripple and stuff, you know it's too big. If your back of your your strap back is um, ri rising up, yes, you know the band is too big, hmm. right? The straps, you know, um, bones in the bra, mm -hmm. right? We try to discourage using now. Nobody in Seneca use a, a, a bone bra for a special occasion, but it shouldn't be something that you use every day because we have lymphatic fluid flowing up and down our chest region, going to the lymph nodes 
to carry out the, 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 the toxins. Mm -hmm. And if you're constantly, we know when you put on a bra and you take it out with that bone, you're seeing the mark yes. there. So it means that it's pressing against your ribcage. Mm -hmm. And because that flow is there, it could stop it from flowing. It can stay uncalcified and turn to a cyst or cancer. So you have to be very careful. So as I say, you use it just as you want to lose weight, but you take a little ice cream now and again. You use the yes. padded bra and now <laughs> the um, wired bra, but it's not something you should use every day. Now, it's a good thing that you shared that because I think one of the things that we see um, just mainstream in retail, all these bras have an underwire. And as you mentioned that as well, sports bras is something that has even become fashionable in some ways as well just to wear as a top. And when you mentioned the indentation afterwards, that's a concern. So now we need to find a bra, which you have for us here, yes. that doesn't actually have all these different details yes, to, as yes, you said, affect yes. your health. Because yes. imagine a bra can affect your health. Yes, yes. My goodness. And you see the whole beauty industry, it, it's changed from what the bra was really made for mm -hmm. to sexiness and sensuality. Yes. So it's all about sexiness. You want this um, breast lift mm -hmm. when, when it's just tissue falling over because there may be a bra that will give you a breast lift. Yeah. But everybody is spending money on that bra. So they just no. buy a bra because it it's too small, mm -hmm. then you get your cleavage because tissue falling out, but it's yes. not really it's not really cleavage. <laughs> it's tissues all over the place. That's, that's it. And <laughs> then and, and two, it can affect your posture as well because yes, if you wear bad yes. bras. Back pains, mm -hmm. shoulder pains, the, the, the straps, the elastic straps, it gives you an indent here, it bruise you mm -hmm. because it's stretch. And when that stretch everything goes out and so does your breast, it goes <laughs> out. And then as you as you age Mm -hmm. Gravity is not your friend anymore. No, it's so not. So you need that lift. That that lift mm -hmm. is what um, your anatomical position of your breast should supposed to be between your second and your seventh rib, right? Yes. So even maternity, that leakage that you mm -hmm. get, That's you not don't normally get it because of the height of your breast and the point of the nipple. It's supposed to be the blood supposed to flow to your nipple. Sometimes you see somebody in a bra mm -hmm. and the nipples is here turning sideways. It's supposed to be centered and pointed so the blood could flow properly. Wow, it's interesting. So and we're talking about um, this bra, and I really want to get into a conversation about this bra yes, right here yes. because we were discussing off air, and one of the things you said is that we can use this for everything, seven every in one event. Yes. A seven in yes. one bra. Yes. It's like yes. a dream. Please yes. tell us more about a seven in so one bra. Me, so let me, let me yes. show you. Let me show yeah. you. Miss okay. Gordon, before you get into the seven and the one, I just want to know because, you know, people like us when we get old and we hit over 40, we start yes. worrying about the, the back fat now. Yes, so and, I just want and, to know. And that is not black fat, that is displaced breast tissue. Oh, Lord have right? mercy. Come and talk about this. Right? <laughs> I it's I need displaced some intervention because, now. as I was telling her, the, the, so the, the, the bus stop. is like um, fatty tissue. Mm -hmm. So it's like jello. If you put it in a. In a um, in, in a container, it will fit into whatever container. That's but remember, cool. when they put jello in a fridge and it gets cold, whatever shaking. excess will flow over. Mm -hmm. It's the same thing. So, you so said there's supposed to be some space, right? Yes. All right, I yes. have the space. And it's supposed to be so, no cleavage. Right? You have no cleavage, cleavage it, but, but, but um, just a little tops. You can have the cleavage, oh, but you have oh. to have the right bra. So, this yeah. is the way sexy you one. use this bra. Okay? Ooh. No, I, I, I dyed it for cancer. The pink and stuff oh, like that. It. Okay? Yeah. So, this is the angel bra. It's truly an angel. Yes. Sent from God. Amen. <laughs> Amen, my sister. Yes. So, we have... This is why we don't need that um, wire. Mm -hmm. It's a suspension band. So, now, if you on. think of a suspension, you know you have the band that you rest... Let's say a crane, mm -hmm. the four chains, mm -hmm. and the band crying the arm um, stuff. So, when you pull on this, this suspension band is what lifts the breast in place. My goodness. So you don't need no wire. Mm -hmm. This is what is giving you support. I need right? that. Mm -hmm. You have the suspension triangle. Yeah. So this is where the breast comes through. So okay. when you put on this bra and you hook it, you lean forward and you pull everything all from the back up and really through this hole here. You stand back up. Make sure everything is inside. Mm -hmm. Then you pull oh up your strap. God. Now if you want a lift, mm -hmm. You use it this way. Okay. If you want to minimize, you roll it down. So hold on. It can do everything. You telling me all these years I'm putting it on my bra wrong. I never bend down and try to kick because, everything up no, in anything. No, because, yes? uh, because most conventional bra yes. don't have 
that there. Yeah, yeah they don't Remember have that. Remember I tell this orthopedic surgeon mm-hmm. that build this bra for persons. Mm-hmm. And when you you understand? Ma- yeah, and when you mentioned as well, this is the f- bra that was designed for women to go into space. Right. Mm-hmm. Gravity. So, so yeah. there's need for the, for the lift. And what is the what is the purpose behind this material? Is it to absorb sweat? Is it, it to helps with absorbing sweat mm-hmm. because I used to have that sweating below too yeah. as a heavy busted person. Mm-hmm. And your skin resting against skin with that bone. Yeah. They don't lift it from your skin. This actually there's no space between hair and hair touching anything. Yeah. Right? It's separate. So there's no sweat and then any little sweat exercise. This takes in the sweat. And this separates. This is why it separates. This is what is supposed to be here. Resting mm-hmm. against here, and this is what separates the breast, right? Even here, the, the, the air is able, because of the fabric as well, there is air to pass through to the skin. It's supposed to have enough air passing. So when you're choosing a bra, you have yeah. to look at the materials that you're choosing, mm-hmm. right? So it prevents hair from sweating, and it separates the girls. Uh-huh. Now, this one is somebody who have a bigger bus mm-hmm. and a smaller bus. Okay. So you work it to suit. Wow. Right? You know, I feel like this is one of those bras. You know, there's nothing, and I'm sure everybody can agree with me. Well, ladies can agree yes. with me. There is nothing better than going home after a long day. First thing you and do. The first thing you do. Good. That's I, when you know it's I the wrong bra. You keep it on this You can keep day. it on all the time. Yes. So and then you hook back this metal hook, as I said, mm-hmm. so it's not plastic. It's a ribbon strap. It's not elastic. Yeah. To burst. If you look at the sides, look how high up the side goes. So it takes in all the tissue here, mm-hmm. as well as the tissues underneath here. My goodness. Right? Oh my when goodness. this is too narrow and you have folds, it mm-hmm. goes into the fold. So when you look at the clothes you're seeing, if you look at the back, yes. oh. look at how high it goes. Yeah. So it takes in all of that. It's broad enough, so it takes in all. It has and shape. does it help to shape you to just yes. build yes. your shape of, yes. I need that. Yes, yes. Mm-hmm. I so need it, that. It gives you the lift. It makes you look good in your clothes. Mm-hmm. There's not, nothing, nothing. There's nothing, sure. no, no, nothing. Nothing. No, nothing. Smooth. Nothing. You know. All here is inside. <gasps> so everything is inside. It encapsulates everything. It gives you that lift. Yeah. It helps with, with the flow. My, my only concern, though, stuff. is that we are so used to uh, bras that... You know, the, the, this thing here stretches. Yes. Mm-hmm. This doesn't stretch. So it means that you have to ensure that your fit is right. Yes. 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 So every, each and every person gets fitted yes, according to measurements and, and, yes, and stuff. Yeah, and it nice. fits you and you try it and everything. So, and so it lasts really long. So that was the other question the, the I wanted hooks to ask. The are metal hooks, so it lasts. Most you could do is... But, I have a question. Sorry, sure. the, the jacket. No, this is kind of not really sure. my uh, my region <laughs> in life and mm-hmm. thing now, boy. But mm-hmm. I'm curious, though. You know, with the pandemic, I think people complain that they would have put on weight, people who lost weight accordingly. Does that affect the size that you would be required to wear? Not, not the put on weight may be a problem in that if your boobs get bigger, mm-hmm. you may have to go to a bigger size. Mm-hmm. But weight loss... It don't really affect it that much because that is why when you buy a bra, make sure it starts on the first of the first one that you meet. So as it lose weight or it stretches, you go to the and second go and you go to the third. Oh. You and if you lose weight, you wouldn't lose the yeah, top well, on, so much. It depending on how much weight you lose, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. right? But a little weight wouldn't wouldn't um, do much. Okay. Right. And if if, if you have a, a big and small bus, if you yeah. have to work with the bigger one. And if you work with the smaller one, you'll get the overflow. I okay. have to ask, how much is one of this retail this for? This is four fifty retail. That's, that's not, not bad, bad at all. No, no. no. At to, all, no, because yeah. realistically, you're going into the store and you're paying the same four fifty for the bad one. Exactly. Yes. I, mean, I don't know yes. how much our brother's yes. retail yes. for yes. in general, so I can't really? can jump in and say, well, you know, that is not a good look no. on you. No, no, you Let wife. me just lean up here and tell you. No, no, no. No, ma'am. That is not a good look. Rockers, that is not a good look. Today you are trying to trying to put in his masculinity. Well, yes, well I don't know how much a brother's retail for while you're No one is good information that I learned now. Yes. Well, and I appreciate the information. There's no need to judge me for being ignorant about something. Jeez. Jeez. This is why men do this. why men do say the truth. Yes. No, okay. This is, right. a I, I so this is a safe space. This is a safe space. But the men need to know I'm because so they have children and they yes. have wives yes, yes, and they yes. have stuff like that. All yeah. right. Question. Just, but if we want to get actually, the right... We're actually out of time for the show. Yeah. But, but go ahead, quickly, quickly. Quick, quick. If we need to get to the right bra size, what's the formula that we need as no, we yeah, go and check you for that. that you have to measure, but I will tell you, you can measure your thorax. Somebody has to measure you from behind. Or mm-hmm. if it is you alone, you do it from in front, very tight below. Here, mm-hmm. you look in the mirror, you write down your thing. Number for you, Miss Gordon. Yes, You're please. Number. Right, so my number is 797-1868. Seven nine seven eight one five five, 
I'm on Facebook, Aura Gordon, or Slim Tastic. Ooh, number yes. four. Yeah. Yes. Slim Tastic from Fantastic. And number, number four. four. All right. It's up on right? the screen there in case you guys missed yes, it. But uh, yes, we want to yes. thank you so much for joining us yes. this morning. All right. It's you, always a pleasure you. to have yes. you on the show. Thank you. Natasha, be Natalie, it's been a pleasure this morning having you on as well. Welcome. Yes. Uh, now Welcome. we'll see you guys tomorrow. Remember to make a difference Free today. No, because <laughs> together, together we aspire. We aspire. Together, together we achieve. Pick up your vaccination card before you leave home. Don't forget. <laughs> see you guys tomorrow.